Hello everyone, welcome back to my tutorials about web scraping and after you setting up an installation with the library I would like to take you to this web page and I will use this web page as an example scrap web page or content from another website is illegal so I'm not responsible for any activities that you did so now let's go to this web page and search something that you want it will listing the items like this okay you can find this easier then inspect the element by right click on this page and we do page source it will show all the page source so the javascript and azac is not load it's just the the raw html so you can copy this and paste it and it will format it okay that have a good for looking so i will get this one i will search it. control c and find out okay i found it you see here because this is the container the whole of the results that we searching here okay i will go to this one so let's copy this url and writing the code let me explain this code offline this is just a clear document that connect to the url that i have copied and paste over here this method is just set time out so by default is three second times out we declare one more elements for the store xtml dom and this method parameter we use uh, cs i mean cs cs attribute right here that we start from here search list so this one is the id id so i copy this so i put sharp okay to after get that i mean this is whole of the container so there are many elements in here i will loop it and because of this is extend from array list of elements as you can see here in this api it is extend from array list and for loop from this array list we have to to use this object element so I have to loop it from element ELE and find the next element so let's go to our html get this one to get an image url so let me go through to line by line in this for each loop that i have loop from this element that have many elements in here loop by using element object so i use this object to select the next element i mean do dot result this one do dot result i mean do that has class result so there are many do that has class result here as you see class result we loop it one by one here and here and here after that i will get the img url by select the do dot result you can see do the class result underscore thumb img text and then we get the value of attribute soc so we put this method and soc attribute so let's print this out as you can see here yes, there are many image url the next i will print out the title i mean here the title here so let's go to the code let's check this with xtml source page okay i get the text from the title i just get it from the element that i have looked it is similar to the image url because it is in the same place i mean this one this one and this one this one is a container of image and this one has the title so i will get this that is in the view text that have class result data here do that have class result data and the inner this class that they have a tag so i have a tag the inner of this a tag they have plant text i mean the raw text here and here 
So I use text method to return the string. I mean, this all will generate as text. The HTML tag will remove and see the result. This is the image and this is the title. You can check here. Five ways to boost a Wi Fi signal. How to improve Wi Fi. This is very simple to scrape the data from the other web page. And if you like my video, don't forget to subscribe.